sir good morning my name is rupal i am from renewable mineral magazine and we are obviously here for rai 2022 after so long what were your expectations from this mega event uh yes so after uh, covid i think it's after two years that we are having a full fledged ari exhibition and we were having very high expectations from them and yes the same we have seen the footfall for the first two days were tremendous and majorly we have met all the developers our customers distributors everyone has gathered along and uh, we have got all the good what you can say the leads that are required for our future businesses through this particular exhibition so we are very happy for that is there any new product launch from your side yes so this year we basically we have launched uh, three new products uh, the first one uh, is what you can say a ev charger uh, in that we are coming up with single phase and three phase ev chargers along with dc chargers in single phase we are having the capacity of 3 and 7 kilowatt whereas in three phase it's 11 and 22 kilowatt and fast dc charger is of uh, 40 kilowatt then we are coming up with an uh, hybrid inverter wit series Uh, which starts from 50 kilowatt onwards up to uh, 100 kilowatt and this is a very uh, interesting uh, product and if you are having any of the customers are having any requirement they can directly uh, contact us for that and the third one which we launched is a portable power source which can give you an output power up to 2000 watt with a battery backup of 1.5 kwh so these are the new three products uh, we have basically launched uh, in this particular rei and yes we are uh, rigorously promoting our utility based inverters that is 250 and 253 kilowatt along with the c and i uh, inverters that is 100 and 125 kilowatt inverters what are the new opportunities that you see for solar market uh basically right now if you are seeing we are uh, going at a very good pace and uh, the target that has been bestowed upon us of 500 gigawatt uh, maybe it will take a year or two more to complete that particular target but yes uh, the overall momentum is very good and we are expecting very good opportunities in the coming years any challenges that you face uh, currently uh challenges in the sense we can say that yes there are some supply chain issues and uh, you know, what we can say shortage of semiconductor devices but uh, as a global company we have already overcome uh, those challenges and yes uh, we are having a pretty good uh, stock for all the semiconductors that are required for the inverters apart from that technology that you are using currently uh, are you working on something like uh, artificial intelligence data analytics kind of technology or digitalization uh, we are having our own uh, smart energy management uh, system which is based on uh, analytical data iot and basically this particular smart energy management system Uh, is very useful for our end customers business partners and yes uh, the integration of ai will definitely help us to reduce the overall operation and maintenance time in future how is your experience till today in rei 2022 oh, frankly speaking the first two days were very hectic and we were happy to have such a good crowd uh, this year the main uh, intention of this particular uh, participation was uh, to get, have a good interaction with all our existing customers along with that the new customers also and i think we have pretty much achieved our uh, motive that uh, we have for this particular rei is there any uh, message that you want to convey to your customers uh, yes uh, this year we are celebrating uh, 10 years in the indian market and we are having a small logo the future is green and sustainable energy and the future is grow what